good, man. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It's that with Frank. We got to, hold on, we got to change the scenery. You know what I'm saying? We in the bathroom today. But hold on, look. Hold on. Mm, I know y'all see the back games. You know what I'm saying? You see the back games, bro. But look, I just want to go ahead and let y'all know something that a lot of y'all are probably not going to want to hear. A lot of y'all might disagree with me, but I just want to be honest and be honest, just honest on this platform. <sighs> Give me a second. I would just like to go ahead and say, bro, to all the people that do this, I don't want to discourage anybody that's doing it. Hey, listen right now. If you're doing it right now, if it works for you, keep doing it. There's too many people that keep want to do things that everybody else is doing. No, bro. If it's working for you, then keep doing it. Stick to it. Make the best of what you can do and what you have, okay? But I just want to let you know right now that the sole definition, the sole action of no fap is a scam. You don't go from being skinny to just being swole once you stop being your meat. You know that, right? And I think a lot of people know that. But some people don't. Like, so I'm being honest with you. Some people truly don't. So, look, I'm going to let you know something right now. Look. Y'all want to know how I got swole? Y'all want to know how I got built like this, by the way? Yeah, Y'all want to know how I got built? I'm going to let you know the story. I was in the bathroom right one day. I was in the bathroom, right? Just finished clapping sheep, you know what I'm saying? I'm staring at myself in the mirror, and I'm like, you know what? I didn't look like this. I wasn't built like this. And I looked at myself, and I'm like, I got small shoulders. I got no traps. I had no abs. I still kind of have no abs because, to be honest with you, I don't hit the abs that much. And I'm just like, you know what? I'm about to go to the gym. I'm about to go to the gym, and I'm about to fix this. That's literally what I said. I literally said, you know what? I'm bad built. I'm about to go to the gym. And I literally was consistent hitting the gym, full body workouts, three times a week for four months straight. And sitting there probably thinking, dang, you were consistent for four months? Yes, I was. <laughs> Did I go on no fap apparently? No. <laughs> Did I go on senior retention? No. So you're probably wondering, well, how did you get big? Without doing those things, you can get big without doing those things. I'm letting you know right now. But what I'm gonna let you know is, if you have to do those things, then by all means, do it. Do what works for you, okay? But if you were just saying, hey man, I'm lazy, I still do the same bad habits, can I just do no fap and we'll fix it? The answer is no. And I think, to be honest with y'all, a lot of y'all know that those things, I figure that a lot of y'all already know that these things don't magically change your life. You have to put in a lot of work, you have to do a lot of self-improvement, you gotta do a lot of extra things in order for you to get to where you wanna be. Now, in all honesty, it's even the same thing with semen retention. Semen retention and no fab are simply just placebo effects. If you do them and it feels like you have more energy, then by all means keep doing that. If you all of a sudden go on semen retention and you start working out, you start smashing bad chicks, you start making a bunch of money, keep doing it. Don't stop, okay? Don't don't, don't listen to me. If it's working for you, keep doing it. But I'm letting you know right now. I've known somebody who's went on no fab, and what does it do? All it makes them do is sit around and say, damn, bro, I'm horny, bro. Man, I can't go back to being my me. So why is he on OFAP, but it's not working for him? Hmm? I thought, no, I gotta stop looking at these. Y'all gotta stop watching YouTube. Y'all gotta stop watching YouTube so much because these YouTubers make these thumbnails and these videos for views. Okay? Just because that dude has a bicep this big and he says, I'll, before no fat, he was a twig and after no fat, he's on a Schwarzenegger. Nigga, no. You wanna know what he did? He decided, I'm tired of beating my meat, and I'm tired of sitting around. He just said, he had this thing called self-awareness, which a lot of y'all don't have. A lot of y'all need self-awareness in order for this stuff to work. Well, in order for these placebo effects to take, to make it. <laughs> the only way these placebo effects can work is if you have self-awareness, or if, you know, or any possible way for these things to seem like they work. You need self-awareness. Because look, you're gonna tell yourself, okay, when I want to watch the senior retention, I told myself, I'm like, look, I can't beat my meat. I can't even edge. Y'all know what edging? Edging is just beating your meat, masturbating without nothing. That's all it is. So I can't edge, right? Because I want to bust, right? I can't smash. I can't get top because I want to bust, right? You do all these things because you want to bust. I can't do those things no more. I could, but if I do them too often at one point, I'm just gonna be like, man, forget this street, man. I need to get this off. And trust me. I've been like that before. I'm a nigga just like you. I've done it before, bro. Don't sit up here and lie to me. So, right, if I can sit there and say, I can't do any of those things, so now I need something else to fill in my time. 
If you can do those things, these quote unquote placebo effects will work. Because as a matter of fact, they're not really placebo effects. All it is is you having self-awareness and telling yourself, you have a self-awareness, seeing the situation that you're in and making the best of it. No fat won't work, semen retention won't work if you don't have self-awareness and your mindset is not different. I'm just letting you know that right now. So don't go out and say, oh, I'm on semen retention or I'm on no fat, but you're edging every day. What, what's the point of you doing that if you're just gonna edge or just... <sighs> point of those things is to, to stop you from thinking from that head and this head. Make you think from this head not that one. That's the only thing it's meant to do. See, it's too many of y'all that keep thinking with that head 24 7. That's the problem with you. It's not no fat. It's not single intention that's going to help you. It's what you need to do up here. Do the work up here. No fat's not going to do anything. You need to change the work up here. You need to stop thinking that all these YouTube videos are just going to help you magically. Fix that. I'm tired of this, bro. And this bathroom's getting hot. So, <laughs> it's that boy Frank, man. And I'm out, bro. Peace.